he went to the doctor and was told that he needed a kidney transplant. I decided that I would be tested, really not thinking that I would ever be a match. And it came back that I was a match. And then I was tested to see if I was physically healthy enough, and I was. So I decided, you know, after a lot of thinking, that this would be a way that I could give something back to the field of music. It had been good to both of us. We spent our lives doing music. And this would be my way to keep him alive and keep his gift alive. Rogerson was really rated high, so we went there and, boy, our eyes were open. <laughs> That's funny, I'm blind, you know. But, <laughs> but anyway, uh, it was like really amazing to go through the experience of Rogerson and the whole thing. Huh? They were very compassionate, very sensitive. We felt that they gave us the knowledge we needed. They did not rush us into the surgery. And we took our time, then set the date, and um, went ahead with the transplant. Yeah, I really thought many, many a night about not being able to play the piano anymore. And with this operation, I was able to be able to play. Uh, here I am today, five years later, and I feel just wonderful. He's been performing and sharing his gift of music with everybody, and that's what we're grateful for. So my prayers were answered.